Japan has long been a global leader in technology, pioneering advancements in fields ranging from robotics to quantum computing. Yet, their latest breakthrough eclipses all previous achievements. This isn't just another remarkable innovation. It's a game-changing force that has left the world in awe, sparking both admiration and fear. But what is this creation? Could it signal the dawn of a new era of technological supremacy? Join us as we delve into the mysteries behind this astonishing development, explore its capabilities, and uncover why it has become so daunting. The JT-60SA Tokamak The JT-60SA Tokamak is a marvel of modern engineering, equipped with cutting-edge plasma control technologies designed for smooth and efficient operation in one of Earth's most challenging environments. This advanced machine features critical systems for heating and current drive, essential for maintaining the plasma, an extremely hot, electrically charged state of matter, under conditions necessary for sustained nuclear fusion. These systems work closely with control mechanisms, including powerful magnetic coils and auxiliary heating devices. The magnetic coils create strong fields to shape and stabilize the plasma, while additional heating systems like neutral beam injectors and radio frequency waves keep the plasma's temperature above 100 million degrees Celsius. Such precise control is crucial to prevent disruptions like plasma instabilities, which could halt the fusion process. Stability is key to achieving a sustained fusion reaction, potentially offering nearly limitless clean energy. Beyond its immediate operational goals, JT-60SA plays a vital role in long-term research. Unlike many reactors, JT-60SA is designed as a platform to pioneer future fusion technologies. It allows scientists to experiment with and refine techniques for more advanced reactors, like the ITER project in France, which aims to produce more energy than it consumes. JT-60SA is at the forefront of the global mission to harness fusion energy, the same force that powers the sun and stars. Located in Naka, Japan, this facility is more than just a reactor. It's a cutting-edge research hub for the future of energy. It's part of an international collaboration between Japan and Europe under the broader approach. Agreement, which complements the ITER project and accelerates the realization of fusion energy. JT-60SA's primary goal is to test advanced plasma control methods, exploring various confinement techniques, such as high beta regimes, which could lead to more efficient and compact reactors. Mastering these techniques could pave the way for the development of commercially viable fusion reactors, providing a nearly inexhaustible source of clean energy and reducing reliance on fossil fuels, thereby mitigating climate change. The experiments here are crucial for understanding how to maintain plasma stability, a key factor in making fusion energy a reality. The project's contributions extend beyond its research, significantly advancing global fusion energy efforts. The discoveries made at JT-60SA are shared with ITER, helping overcome challenges and refine processes, accelerating the progress of fusion science, and bringing us closer to a future powered by clean, sustainable energy. JT-60SA is making major strides in nuclear fusion, constantly updating its research based on new findings from ITER. Originally designed to support ITER, JT-60SA is now focusing on the needs of future fusion reactors. The project's goals have expanded to include enhancing steady-state operations and exploring new plasma scenarios for upcoming fusion power plants like DEMO. Moreover, the project emphasizes international collaboration, particularly between Europe and Japan, which is essential for tackling the technical challenges and building a skilled team of researchers and engineers. This growing community is crucial for preserving and expanding the knowledge needed for future fusion projects, ensuring today's advancements pave the way for tomorrow's energy solutions. The Quest for Infinite Clean Energy The JT-60SA isn't just another research facility. It's a glimpse into the future of energy. This advanced installation uses cutting-edge superconducting magnets and sophisticated plasma control systems, setting a new standard for global energy research. It represents the promise of fusion energy, clean, sustainable, and nearly limitless power without the carbon emissions of fossil fuels. Beyond its technological feats, the JT-60SA is crucial for advancing our understanding of plasma physics, essential for making fusion energy a practical and reliable power source. This represents a significant leap in the quest for groundbreaking energy solutions that could transform how we power our world. Japan's JT-60SA, a marvel of engineering, uses powerful superconducting magnets to confine superheated plasma within a donut-shaped tokamak chamber. This plasma reaches temperatures hotter than the sun's core, over 100 million degrees Celsius, which is vital for initiating fusion. A process where light atomic nuclei merge to form heavier ones, releasing tremendous energy. 
Currently the largest and most advanced reactor of its kind, the JT-60SA supports the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor ITER, project in France, the world's largest fusion experiment aimed at demonstrating fusion as a large-scale, carbon-free energy source. On October 26, 2023, after nearly 15 years of design, construction, and testing, the JT-60SA achieved a major milestone by generating its first plasma. This success validates years of global collaboration and sets the stage for future experiments to expand our knowledge of fusion. Sam Davis, the project manager at Fusion for Energy, announced that everything is running smoothly. Fusion for Energy, an EU initiative, collaborates closely with Japan's National Institutes for Quantum Science and Technology to monitor and analyze the reactor's performance. At the heart of the JT-60SA is nuclear fusion, often seen as the holy grail of energy production. This process involves two smaller atomic nuclei merging to form a larger nucleus, releasing more energy than current nuclear fission methods. Fusion happens in plasma, a hot, chaotic mix of charged particles, reaching temperatures similar to the sun's core. If scientists can control and sustain fusion, it could provide an almost endless supply of clean energy, with minimal radioactive waste and fuel derived from seawater and lithium. Despite progress, significant challenges remain. Controlling and stabilizing such a powerful reaction requires advanced technology and precise engineering. The Takamax magnetic confinement must be finely tuned to prevent plasma from touching reactor walls, which could lead to failure. While practical nuclear fusion is still a way off, the JT-60SA's progress is a monumental step toward clean, limitless energy. Plasma, the medium for fusion, is distinct from solids, liquids, and gases, and is crucial for various high-tech applications on Earth. Scientists have been captivated by fusion energy since 1925, when Arthur Eddington proposed that stars generate energy through nuclear fusion. Despite the technical hurdles, the potential benefits of fusion continue to drive scientific efforts. Fusion Power A small amount of hydrogen isotopes used as fuel for fusion reactions can generate energy equivalent to almost 10 metric tons of coal. Since the inception of nuclear fusion, scientists have been striving to recreate and control this powerful process. If mastered, nuclear fusion promises an almost limitless supply of clean, cost-effective, and environmentally friendly energy capable of meeting global demands. However, achieving fusion on an industrial scale presents enormous challenges. Fusion energy has the potential to produce four times more energy per kilogram than the nuclear fission used in current power plants, fueling scientists' relentless pursuit to make it a viable energy source. The idea of a power source millions of times more potent than fossil fuels like coal or oil is compelling. Modern fusion reactors typically use tritium and deuterium, hydrogen isotopes with extra neutrons. Not only is fusion fuel extremely powerful, but it is also relatively accessible. Tritium can be produced by having fusion neutrons interact with lithium, which is naturally abundant, while deuterium can be extracted from seawater. Fusion energy also avoids the dangerous, long-lasting radioactive waste associated with traditional nuclear power, offering a safer alternative for both the environment and human health. Future fusion reactors are designed with rigorous safety measures. If something goes wrong, the reaction halts automatically, and the plasma dissipates quickly, preventing any lasting damage. Fusion energy's rapid fuel consumption reduces the risk of uncontrolled reactions or meltdowns. The difficulty of starting and maintaining a fusion reaction is what ensures its safety. Unlike fossil fuels, nuclear fusion and fission do not emit harmful greenhouse gases, making them promising for a cleaner future. Nuclear fusion, which powers the sun, could potentially generate low-carbon electricity. In the sun, fusion occurs naturally due to immense gravitational pressure that compresses hydrogen atoms into helium, releasing energy. Replicating this process on Earth requires extreme conditions, including temperatures exceeding 100 million degrees Celsius, seven times hotter than the sun's core. Achieving and controlling such temperatures, along with managing magnetic fields and precise pressure, is a significant challenge. Devices like Tokamax and Stellarators use powerful magnets to create a magnetic field that contains the hot plasma where fusion occurs. This field must be incredibly strong and stable to prevent the plasma from touching the reactor walls, which could cool it down or damage the equipment. The objective is to sustain the fusion reaction long enough to generate more energy than is needed to start it. Current experiments, such as those at the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor ITER, in France, are making progress toward demonstrating a net energy gain from fusion. However, challenges remain, including improving energy confinement efficiency and maintaining plasma stability. ITER's construction costs have exceeded $2 billion, 
and maintaining internal temperatures and magnetic fields requires advanced technology and materials. Scientists are working diligently to overcome these challenges, focusing on new materials and innovative designs to make fusion reactors more practical and affordable. Despite the obstacles, the potential benefits of nuclear fusion are immense. If successful, fusion could offer a nearly limitless source of clean energy using abundant resources like seawater and producing minimal radioactive waste compared to fission. This could transform the global energy landscape, providing a sustainable solution to growing energy needs. What do you think about Japan's recent revelation of developing something so incredibly powerful that it's become frightening? Share your thoughts in the comments below.